Hi, I'm Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. Today we're studying a song called Television, The Drug of the Nation. I think the lyrics in this song are interesting to study, and this could also be a good song to study in a class or a study group, or just a group of friends. The song says that TV is like an addictive drug that makes us stupid. TV is the reason why less than 10% of our nation reads books daily, why most people think Central America means Kansas, socialism means un-American, and apartheid is a new headache remedy. I'm not sure why people would think apartheid is a headache remedy. Maybe the word is similar to a headache remedy in the US. Anyway, do you know what apartheid is? It is the system of segregation or discrimination on grounds of race in force in South Africa from 1948 to 1991. Two of the questions in the song that I think are really interesting are TV, is it the reflector or the director? Does it imitate us or do we imitate it? Kia ora in Stig News today, a town called Denny asked to be given the award for the worst town in Scotland after another town refused to accept it. The Carbuncle Award is given to the town in Scotland with the worst planning and architecture. This year's winner was a town called John O'Groats, but apparently no one from the town was keen to collect the award so people from another town said that have it. Residents from Denny said they hoped the award would pressurise local authorities into doing something to improve their town. And that was Stick News for Friday the 24th of September. Kia ora. Today's word is oxymoron. An oxymoron is a phrase that combines two words that seem to be the opposite of each other. For example, a deafening silence. In the song, they give some examples of oxymoronic language that they say has become standard on TV. Virtually spotless, fresh frozen, light yet filling, military intelligence. Can you think of any other oxymorons? Daddy, I got an A in spelling. You fool, there's no A in spelling. Do you watch much TV? Really? Why not? So you never watch TV? Well, I don't have a TV. Because my place is too small, so I think it'd be a waste of a corner. No, but I watch TV shows on the internet, so it's the same thing. But heaps better, because you can watch them when you want to. Showing no interest or enthusiasm. A. Apartheid. B. Apathetic. C. Imitate, D, oxymoron, E, spotless, apathetic, perfectly clean, spotless. A phrase that combines two words that seem to be the opposite of each other. Oxymoron. The system of segregation or discrimination on grounds of race in force in South Africa from 1948 to 1991. Apartheid, to copy somebody or something. Imitate. And that was The Daily English Show. Thank you for watching and if you have any feedback about the show we'd love to hear from you. Please leave a comment or send us an email, thedailyenglishshow at gmail.com. See you tomorrow. Bye.